Okay, hello there. Um, following on from my last video to do how to build a ratchet sequencer uh, with the Nomnosphere, there's one other little tip I'd like to pass on to you. Um, we know that we've got these delays here being modulated by mod envelopes. Now, the thing with mod envelopes is, in Nomnosphere, we've got these little things here called Oto. So, Without them, we have just so how does the ratchet. Now these little curves here uh, decide when the ratchet starts. Now, for a little bit of sort of um, variety, if you engage the auto, these will change every single loop. So instead, we get this. So each sequence <coughs> that it revolves around is never the same. So even more variety. And that's the uh, an octave of C's apart down the bottom end, but you can actually get this to sound even crazier by playing uh, the note C an octave higher. So you've got three octaves of the C's going at once. So that's one, one note on its own. That's the C above it. And we add another C. And as you can hear, each loop Back to that. Each loop's changing as it goes through. So the delays are happening differently every time. The yeah, ratchets aren't exactly in the same place. You can go a bit crazy. So there we go. Nice little quick tip for you. So until next time, catch you later.